The strata reforms will introduce a new form of strata known as community title schemes. A community title scheme is a new form of strata which involves multiple sub-schemes existing under an umbrella community scheme. Each sub-scheme has its own strata company. Each of those strata companies operate under an umbrella community corporation. Community schemes exist in other states including New South Wales and Queensland. Community schemes are ideal for large-scale development. Large sites take many years to develop in several stages and community title provides flexibility in how those stages are developed by setting this out clearly to buyers and owners. Community schemes will introduce community property. Community property will ensure you have statutory rights to use facilities if you pay levies to maintain those facilities. The obligation to maintain those facilities will be set out in the Act. Disputes about who can use and who pays to maintain those facilities will be resolved through the State Administrative Tribunal. Sharing facilities and strata is not simple now. Strata schemes can share facilities owned by another scheme. However, to share facilities now, you need complex agreements to set out who has rights to use the facilities of another scheme and who must pay to maintain the facilities in another scheme. These agreements are hard to enforce and cause many disputes. The Act introducing community schemes will clearly set out community property can be used by all the owners within the community scheme and is maintained by the community corporation using levies paid by the owners within that community scheme. Secondary community property can be used by all the owners within the secondary community scheme, which is a sub-scheme and is maintained by the secondary community corporation using levies paid by the owners within that secondary community scheme. Common property can be used by all the owners within the community strata scheme, which is also a sub-scheme. And that common property is maintained by the community strata company using levies paid by all the owners within that community strata scheme. For example, if a community scheme operates a pool as community property, all the owners of the lots within that community scheme, even if they own a lot in a sub-scheme, pay levies to the community corporation to maintain that pool. All the owners also have a right to use the pool, even the owners in a sub-scheme. Community schemes facilitate mixed use. Community schemes enable multiple sub-schemes to be created, with each sub-scheme having a different use and different common property which matches that use. Mixing use in strata now is not easy. Currently, a strata scheme can mix uses, such as retail with residential and office space. For example, in a mixed-use scheme where retail shops, office space and residential apartments coexist, the retailers want the strata company to spend all of the money on maintaining the retail facilities, like the escalators. The residents of the apartments don't want retail visitors using the common property pool or gymnasium. The residents don't want to pay to maintain or upgrade the office tower lifts. But the Act does not provide clear guidance on who is responsible for the different types of common property in that type of scheme. The Act doesn't set out who can use that common property and it also doesn't set out who needs to pay to maintain those different types of common property. Community schemes allocate costs and rights clearly. The retail strata company is responsible for managing and maintaining the retail facilities. Those retail facilities include the retail common property, such as retail walkways and escalators. The office strata company is responsible for managing and maintaining the office common property, including the lifts to the office tower. The residential strata company is responsible for maintaining the residential common property, including the pool, the gym and the garden. Each of these strata companies match a sub-scheme within the community scheme and all operate under the community corporation.